Wow, feels like we're in a movie. Here goes your World War III news. We have reports that Ukraine has done one of their largest attacks on Moscow to this date. Listen to this, and I have a couple videos. You can hear explosions and sirens blaring. Here's another one. We also got a Lebanon attack on Israel as well. And we do got some airstrike videos on Israel hitting Lebanon. Here's another one. Hezbollah launched 50 missiles at Israel last night. Here's the airstrike. And here's Hezbollah firing missiles towards Israel. All right, let's get on with the news. We had American PMC group, which is a mercenary group that posts pictures of them invading into Kursk. When they were asked to comment if they were helping Ukraine, they said ask the Ukrainian army. They are not allowed to talk. Here's the one that says they are not allowed to comment. If you wanted to read through. Russia called this provocative and summoned the U.S. envoy over the presence of U.S. mercenaries on Russian territory. So it's safe to say they're pretty angry about this. It is being reported by the UK that the Houthi rebels launched an attack on a vessel with three projectiles and three, all three projectiles hit its target. The ship initially exchanged fire with two small vessels, one with three to five people on board while the second was carrying around ten people. This report is fairly new so I'll keep you guys updated with this. Here's another article of a tanker reporting an attack off of Yemen's coast, of course. Here's more photos of Ukraine's attack on Moscow, too. Showing a couple areas that show smoke and that was affected by their drones. I think this one's the best one. Crazy, right? We have China seriously concerned after a report alleging U.S. nuclear strategy change, which I reported on in my last video, which was the United States getting ready for nuclear confrontation with China, Russia, and North Korea. We have the Philippines deploying fighter jets and patrol gunboats as things are starting to escalate with Beijing. This comes as one of Beijing's vessels hit the Philippines vessels yesterday, which also rose tensions. Here's a report of Hezbollah launching the 50 rockets towards Israel. And here's the one about the drone attacks on Moscow as well. Anyways, much love guys. More news next.